Okay. Miss. Sis. Miss. Te. Miss. Me. <laughs> Excuse me. Is, is key in English is very difficult. Ah, uh, Miss. Me. Me. Alok, how are you? Mm -hmm. Welcome to Colombia. Thank you. I'm so happy to be here. I, I am very happy too that you are meeting me because I am so influencer here in Colombia. I think you're the most fashionable person I've met. Oh my God. Uh, <laughs> yes, yes, I think so. You are almost as, 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 as fierce as I am. I'm, I can only hope. That's yeah, my dream. Yeah. I can give you some tips <laughs> at the end of the interview. <laughs> you are dressing like that. Because you are meeting me, is this a, like a special occasion? Yes, first and foremost. <laughs> <laughs> it was my biggest honor when I got this invitation. I've been a big fan from afar. I want to let you know you have a global following. In the US, we watch your videos for style inspiration. And I think you should be debuting at New York Fashion Week next year. Oh. <laughs> well, thank you, thank you. I'm going to ask my manager if I can. Yes, yes, if you have time in your schedule. Yeah, we'd yes, love to yes, have you. I, I, have I can to, imagine you're very busy. I have to cook and I'll do a lot yes. of things. Yes. But what I heard is that a lot of people here believe that there's certain clothes for men and certain clothes for women. And mm -hmm. I think that's very unfashionable. I feel like actually clothes should be about creating who you are, establishing your own sense of self. Okay, so, but for example, those earrings are like better for, for me. I think a lot of the violence that we experience as non-binary people is because people are envious because they didn't know that they could be this free. So that was a very great illustration of that encounter. Mm. <laughs> okay, yes. You should add performance artists to your bio as well. Oh, okay, yes. <laughs> I'm so nervous. <laughs> so, yes, now that you mention, uh, you know that in my neighborhood, there is a guy, he's a young man, and he dresses in such a colorful and such a particular way, like very, mm, mm -hmm. like, like similar to you. Yeah. you. You understand, right? Yeah. So I don't like when the people in the neighborhood laugh at him. Yeah. I really don't like because he's a very hardworking man right. and he helps his mother in the bakery and and I, I I don't like because he's a nice person. Why do you think people laugh at, at people like? Yeah, because they are showing their own hurt because someone laughed at them when they were younger and told them that they couldn't be different or be themselves. And so it's easier to make fun of someone else than it is to sit with your own pain. And I think ultimately, people who are confident in themselves don't feel the need to comment on anyone else. It's just, oh, that's another person. Cool. It's not a big deal. It only becomes a big deal because there's something left unprocessed inside of you. Oh, you're right. This was Auntie Nohara, influencer for Sentido.